Uh, I've been producing TEFI Award for Russian Academy of Television for 25 years now, and we've been always doing it from the very beginning. And, uh, and now this is our award that I make, and that's for your festival. And I'm very proud about that. And that was in uh, 81, I believe. Uh, I didn't want to go to art school. Uh, I, wanted to, uh, I wanted to learn from other artists. So I have uh, made, an, I have, I made an effort to, to meet artists in New York, and one of those artists was Ernst Nieziesny. I just knocked on his door. In Soho, I found his address from a magazine called New American, that had an article about him back then. I knocked on his door, and he welcomed me in, and uh, uh, I became like his apprentice. He became my teacher. We became really, really good friends. We started to collaborate on different projects. I was helping him with a lot of different aspects of the studio work. He taught me a lot of things about sculpture. I worked with him his whole life in America, basically. Uh, it was an open door studio. It was the most amazing place. It was a place where everyone uh, would, uh, would go to to meet with Ernst, to talk about art, to talk about literature, to talk about politics, to talk about philosophy. Uh, anybody could walk in and look at his work and uh, have a conversation. He was the most open person at that point. And uh, it was really, really interesting place to be, to just hang around and to spend time there. And uh, I would be helping him with something uh, with plaster or mold making. I'll be learning a lot of things and then we'll be taking a break. We would sit down at the table. We would have a, a great conversation. It could go all the way till three in the morning sometimes. It was just an amazing time then. He uh, presented uh, your festival with a wonderful drawing. Uh, that um, I believe that he intended to make into an actual, actual award at some point, but unfortunately he passed away and it remained just a drawing, a one-line sketch, outline of it. And um, I was really honored uh, that I was asked to uh, interpret that sketch and create uh, a word uh, in memory of Ernst Nieziesny, in his spirit, in his sculptural line. And um, I was very happy to do that. I was I'm really proud that, uh, that I could do that. I used that line, uh, drawing, and I imagined how it would look in a three-dimensional three shape. I, uh, I imagined how Ernst would sculpt it. Uh, I tried to be true to his spirit of his forms and volumes and shapes and, and of course I had to invent the actual shape, how it would work in a three-dimensional form. I had to add some elements to it to make it into an actual word. And so, so the drawing was, the drawing was just an outline of that human body, a person pointing one, one hand, one arm down, and in the right, arm, right hand holding, holding a tree of life. So what I wanted to do from that drawing, uh, I wanted to create a, a, rough, a rough kind of basic shape, which is like a two by four piece, which is right here, out of which a, a form, a human, a human body is formed, is shaped, comes out of that, and it is wrapped round in a film, which is a little bit dated today. Today nobody is using film, but but uh, we know what it, what this signifies, and and the idea is that that out of out of art, 
out of documentaries, out of films, we learn how to how to become more human, how to uh, how to carry a tree of life in our heart, and this is the meaning of that award. That that films, documentaries, art shapes us and creates in us a spirit that allows us to tell good from evil, right from wrong, and interesting from boring. And so from a line drawing this became a three-dimensional award and, uh, and I hope Ernest will be proud of the final result.